game. It was one nothing. Took some massive chances by resting some players tonight. First choice, starting 11. I think a race we go between Hamas and Olave and Dominic Oduro. Now it's Paladini, Papa, the chip scores! Marco Papa has just scored his first goal since late June. And that's how you make a statement in the first 10 minutes of the match. Well, Marco Papa finding time and space at the corner of the 18-yard box. We know Papa's ability with that left foot. This time, it's going to be with his right. Starts with a simple throw-in. Quickly taken. Niako finds the splitting run. Palladini sets it up. Look at this finish. Whoever knew Marco Papa could finish like that with his right foot. Gets his head up. Olave bites. Papa steps up last second. Long time coming for Marty. Six minute. Dan Garden. Logan Paws, Frankie Klopas has been saying he's encouraging Logan to go forward more when he gets the chance. Papa going forward, the shot, make it two! Big Papa back in a big way. How about them Chicago Fire leading 2-0 here in the 36th minute. Well, Marco Papa making it 2-0 on the road for Chicago. What a great finish. Talked about his left foot. Just pure placement. But watch the turn right here from Pablo Pardo. Here, Donny Alvarez gets caught cheating. Pardo gets his head up. Borchers tries to make the read. Amison Olave is too slow to get over because he's worried about the run of Oduro. But the amazing thing, Brian, is the production from Marco Papa tonight for the Chicago Fire. Some of it you could probably blame from him having to go on trips for Gold Cup, play for Guatemala. But earlier in the season, he just didn't seem to be engaged all the time. As here's Marco Papa, pretty engaged down the right flank, into the box for the hat trick. He's got it! Big Papa! Big performance on the road! And he's picking up the Chicago Fire, putting him on his back, and going for a little slide here at Rio Tinto. The Chicago Fire bench celebrating. 3 nothing on the road, Marco Papa, hat trick, and what an incredible finish. Gets underneath, uses Chris Schuler's size against him, gets his head up, isolated. Arcel does everything right. Nick Romando does everything right. Marco Papa does everything right. Look at this speed. Initial bump, gets his head up, wants the left foot, gets it. He put it in the only place that Nick Romando couldn't get it. Back from behind, recognizing that you can run out more valuable time off the clock. And we saw that against New England as the Chicago Fire they ain't dead yet. A shocking road win, just their second win of the season, and their first win since June 12th. They upset Real Salt Lake on the road and moved closer to their dream of the MLS Cup playoffs.